Hey guys, that Monkey Gamer back here for another video. This is another online gameplay. Draft Champions, of course. And to start the game, we do return to kickoff with sweetness. And honestly, that's a great way to start any kind of games. As you know, being a Madden fan, being a Madden player in general, when you start out with a kickoff return, you know, you know that game's just gonna go your way. You know the equalizer BS is on your side. And right here, we actually get an interception too. To, so already we got you know touchdown and interception our defense is working right our kickoff squads working right all we got to do now is fix our offense and that's the one thing that we seem to not be able to fix so far in the game is our offense is not doing as great so right here we roll out to our right on third and 14 we somehow find a guy wide open and is able to get the first down right here we hand it off to the left Sweetness gets about eight yards, so after we turn the kickoff, you know, Sweetness is hopefully gonna get us back into some kind of game plan and stuff like that. But right here, Joseph Randall, it looks like, gets about six yards, and that's pretty much our game plan. I think I told you guys last episode in, in this like online gameplay draft champion series that we are trying to run the ball at, to the best of our ability. And the more we run the ball, I feel like the more we're able to establish the fact that we don't have to pass it unless we need to. And that's the biggest thing when it comes to Madden. If you can run the ball down someone's throat, like for example, and if you think no one does this, problem right. All he runs is inside zone. No offense to the man, like he's a great Madden player. But his main play on offense is inside zone. And, you know, if no one can stop him with inside zone, he's just going to keep running it. And therefore, you know, it's so you know, difficult to print against him because he's kind of like a Randy Moss. You know, Randy Moss, everyone knew he was going to just run deep. No matter what happened, we knew, hey, he's just going to run deep. But no matter everyone knowing that, you could like every single player on your team could know that. The problem was it was impossible to stop him. That's the whole entire idea is anyone could run deep in the NFL, but Randy Moss would and he would instantly get touchdowns. So the whole idea is, as you can see right here, I am passing it just for video sake, you know, to keep it more entertaining for you guys. But if people cannot stop it, don't stop doing it. And this is actually a really good play. It's called Tight End Cross. It's out of the Falcons playbook. Um, a lot of different playbooks have it. It's, um, I think it's out of the Bears playbook too. It's shotguns and then the first, um, first one in shotgun formation. It's called tight end cross. Other plays I recommend would be out of split close. Again, the Falcons playbook has that play too. Can you tell I won the Falcons playbook? I love the Falcons playbook. Best offensive playbook in my opinion. Other than the Panthers, of course. But yeah, so split, close, strong, um, strong toss, which I think they're going to probably nerf next year because this year it was very, very OP. So most likely they're going to nerf it so that it's not OP next year. So as you can see, my opponent is moving the ball pretty nicely on me. Although being down 14 points, right here somehow my guy drops the interception. Well, he didn't really drop it. He just was going, he wasn't, he was going to go for it, but he's like, I'll just swat it down instead. That's probably like the worst animation you can get as a Madden player is when, you know, the, the guy just swats, your guy just swats the ball down. First down 10 here, my opponent throws it and gets down to my three yard line. So just like that, my opponent is in striking range and he ends up scoring a touchdown right there. Um, I did kick a field goal, so I skipped a little bit forward. Um, and now we are up by 10 points, but my opponent is not going to give up actually drops the ball right there sadly for him or else he would have had a nice freaking completion right here he throws it and his interception he will intercepted he was under pressure therefore that is why the interception did occur first down and 10 here i walked i run to my left and not able to get anything bringing up second down and 10 and also the beginning of the fourth quarter i walk to my right with tight end cross of course I catch the ball and somehow his defender straight up just like doesn't even try to tackle me. So I get a touchdown, making it 31 to 14 here. 17 point lead, definitely a nice lead. Right there, I didn't have no idea where his quarterback was going. His quarterback just right, did some random throw there. 
Right here, he ends up doing uh, incompleting the pass after his player gets hit. They're down in 10 now, and my opponent looks to his left, and I'm right there, but I'm not able to get the interception. So he does catch it to about the 44-yard line on my side. Um, he's trying to he trying to keep consistently hitting the out routes, and that's the one thing that I gotta say about my defense in like, general. Like when you play me, I am bad at stopping out routes, and I definitely hate playing them. So right here though, I we do intercept the ball. And it will be a pick six, so we got a kick return for six and a pick six in one game, guys. Everything's going for six. I think I'm going to title the video that everything is going for six. Um, but right here, my opponent does not give up. And that's the one thing I got to say about my opponent is he did not give up. I mean, being down 24 points with almost two minutes to go in this game and he is still, you know, continuing to try his best to, you know, put up some points. So definitely, you know, it is draft champion. So I think this is ranked draft champion. So if you do quit, it's not as, you know, disrewarding or well, not disrewarding, but it's not as penalization as it would be with regular draft champions where you lose one and you're out. This one, it's like, you know, you lose two and then you're out. So Unless this was his second game, and then he was just kind of like, I'm not going to give this guy a free win. I don't know. Still cap out to my opponent. Very good guy. Very good player at Madden, too. But right here, third and 18. Um, he does end up converting the first down, thankfully for him. But he does end up throwing to his halfback here, getting out of bounds, trying to save all the time he can. But sadly, that will not be enough, because right here, first down and 10. My opponent looks, looks, throws, and is intercepted. So thank you so much for watching. Please rate, comment, subscribe. See you guys in the next one.